welcome back to Erin Rules XD and in today's video we will be making chunky chocolate muffins. Now this recipe makes six muffins and I have made these before and they are delicious. I have already preheated the oven to 200 degrees. Now the ingredients you will need for this delicious recipe are 50 grams of plain dark chocolate 50 grams of light brown sugar 25 grams of butter 125 millilitres of milk half a teaspoon of vanilla essence one medium egg 150 grams of self-raising flour half a teaspoon of baking powder a pinch of salt and 75 grams of chocolate drops. Now guys, let's get into the baking. Okay, first thing we have to do is line the muffin tray with oil so that it doesn't stick. So we just have to add a little drop and move it round the pan and you don't need a lot of oil and to the next one over here okay on to the next step as i've melted the butter and the chocolate have a look and you may need a parent to help you with this bit. It looks cool. So we have let the chocolate cool for a bit and now we add in the sugar and butter. Sugar first. In goes the sugar and in goes the butter. And now the fun part, we get to stir. Gives her arm another workout. You have to make sure all of the sugar is down from the side of the bowl. It's looking good so far guys, what do you think? My arm's getting tired already. We have to crack our medium egg and lightly beat it. Yeah, a little bit more. That. Until you see wee breaks on it. And try not to get any shell in it. Do you guys see any shell? No shell. Perfect. Now we have to lightly beat it. And just whisk it up. How long do we beat it for? Not too long. A minute? Yeah, about that. Another right. arm, another workout. Right. Now we have to add the milk, the vanilla essence and our egg. So first, the milk. Now the vanilla. And last but not least, our beaten egg. And we have to give that a stir. Are you a bit slower so it doesn't go everywhere? Okay. And then do you just eat that stuff straight out the bowl? Is that no, your... it's raw egg. Alright. And it's not even shaped yet. And we haven't even added the chocolate chips yet. It doesn't look like a muffin right now, does it? No, it's mainly just clouds. <coughs> and brown stuff. Okay. Uh, that we are now going to sieve the salt, baking powder and flour. So first we have the flour and we pour it in here. Right, sieve that. And we sieve it. And now the baking powder, which is 
a half half a teaspoon. So we'll try and not. In fact, I'll keep it over this bowl. Will that do? Can you see the half teaspoon? Yep. Now you put it straight into the mixture. And put oh. that in there. Yeah, you can do that. And a pinch of salt. Literally a pinch. And put that in there too. You want to try and serve? I'll try. Don't you go like that? Mm -hmm. Or something? Yeah, Just don't let it lie down like that. Which is all going out as much as possible. I think these little guys might want to move. Come on, guys. It's like they're having a party in there while mm. I'm tapping them. Dad, them straight in. Straight in. Boom. And now we get a mix metal spoon and we fold it. Can I just show you how to fold? Yes, please. So you need to get down and round so you're not, it's not like a stir. When does the fish go in? The, the fish? We are not making it with fish. No, that, that isn't even in the recipe at all. Mm. Can you see the chocolate? Is that in the so, ingredients? And to make sure all of the powder. Oh, I can smell that from here, guys. It's so nice. <laughs> now we have to divide our cake mixture into the muffin tray. Would you like me to show you? Yeah, step. just get on with it. Stop showing off and just get on with it. Right, so one. Oh, get that's that. sloppy. Oh no! Oh, um, right. Okay. Um, I'm a messy cook. Yeah, right well, into the middle. That up later. Okay, right. You do next. And we just go like that. Mhm. Mm into right into the middle. I was better than you that one. I think you were. Right. Next and one. And our next one over here. Right into the middle. And next one over here. Good. Because these are going to rise. This one has raw egg in This mixture has raw egg in yeah, it, doesn't that's it? that's why we're going to put it in the oven, isn't it? So don't try it from here. Right. And that's us, I think. Right. Maybe a little bit more in there. Thank you. Uh, and how long do these take before they're ready? 20 to 25 minutes. So how long should we put them on for? I would recommend 20. check it at 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. And then if, you, if they've still not risen then why don't we do too to much, 25? then you add it for an extra five minutes. Right. So let me get a quick look at them before we put All them right. in the oven. I'll set the timer. Ignore the splodge that's on the, on the surface. There you go. And you put them straight in. And right. I will add on 20 minutes. Right, you want to put the in since it's quite hot? Yes, go, because I've got the timer ready. In we go! And should we start the timer? Yes! Started! Okay guys, we've got 19 minutes and 56 seconds to go. And what are you going to do to kill the time right now? Erin's going to dance for us! Okay, what uh, have I to do? No, Erin's going to clean up. And floss. And I get V bucks for every one I do. Okay, fine, robot. What are you doing? Capturing a rare event of Erin doing the dishes on video. Are you seriously putting this on the video? Yep. Okay. Okay, guys. So I'm doing the dishes right now. I never heard that camera go on. You know that? From all of the stuff I've done so far. How many minutes till the muffins are ready? 15 minutes. Well, they should be ready in 15 minutes. But if not, we'll add them on for an extra five. Oh, starting to rise already. Uh, got it. Um, when did you start recording by any chance? Stop.
stop. Hey okay, guys, we're down to the last 10 seconds right now and um, you have to let them cool for around 10 minutes or so on a baking tray if you have it and there we go and you have to you you can ask an adult for help to take our muffins out of the tray and they are looking pretty tasty the one has flopped a wee bit <laughs> This guy right here. But, the but one, that one, they two, I think, are the best ones. The three here are looking quite good as well. In fact, five out of the six, I think, look quite good. This wee guy's just not wanting to move. And that wee baby one's not risen that well. Um, so how long do we leave them for? Ten minutes. Where do we put them now to cool? On this. On a wee wire rack, it. if you've got one. Guys, we have let them cool and have a look. Now this recipe was fairly easy and I really recommend you guys to try it and comment down below how you got on. So hopefully they'll come out okay. Yeah because we've oiled the pan. Oh, oh look at out. this. Okay so I'm going to so be taste up. testing this. Looks good. And the hot. Oh. Oh yeah. No, that's a good cake. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to smash that subscribe button, hit the like button, and tap the notification bell. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!